China project to protect hundreds of thousands of people from catastrophic flooding broke ground today. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers is raising the height of the Folsom Dam, an effort that is years in the making. ABC 10's Monica Coleman is live at Folsom Lake with a look at why this matters to so many people in the area, Monica. Hey guys, probably not tonight, but usually Folsom Lake is a great place to go swimming or maybe go water skiing with friends. But if a natural disaster hits, engineers say that this dam behind me can really be detrimental to people and unleash a deadly flood. That's why local leaders are taking a proactive approach here in the Sacramento region. Three, two, one. After half a decade of planning the Folsom Dam Raids project, it's finally set to go. We did so much and spent a lot of money with the whole thing with the spillway, which is, but that came under budget and we got it done more quickly. But sometimes, you know, you get people say, well, we did a lot already, but this is the last piece of it. I always felt we got to get this done too. California Democrat U.S. Congresswoman Doris Matsui has been working on all things flooding in Sacramento since 2005 and it's at the forefront of the Folsom Dam race. This part of it is really important because it really does deal with retaining the more water and being able to um, have it here instead of dumping the whole thing over. So now we are able now to understand that we can do both. Matsui says raising the dam will help the Sacramento region avoid the same kind of devastation that New Orleans saw with Hurricane Katrina back in 2005. <laughs> raising parts of Folsom Dam three and a half feet might sound like a small increase, but the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers say that could potentially save 440,000 people and $58 billion in assets. Now what's great is they're looking at Sacramento as a good example of our response and the fact that we just don't stop. We look ahead. The work will be done on the eight dikes and the right and left dams. There will also be a modification to the spillway. Excuse me, construction at Folsom Lake has already begun, but the project will wrap up around 2025. Chris Madison. Mm -hmm.